Banyana Banyana head coach Desari Ellis has pinpointed the positive from their twin one defeat to Sweden in their FIFA Women's World Cup Open at the Wellington Regional Stadium on Sunday. The prestigious tournament is currently underway in Australia and New Zealand. South Africa took the lead in the 48 minute of the showpiece through Hilda Magai. But Sweden came back from the goal down to beat Ellis charges following Lebohang Ramalepe's own goal in the 68th minute. Ellis then scored the winning goal in the last minute of the game, breaking the hearts of SA fans. In the sport match interview, Ellis pointed out the positive despite their defeat to the European nation. A lot of positives to take away from this game. I thought we were really doing good on the ball, said Ellis. We worked a lot on the defense and also worked a lot of step pieces and I thought we handled those two areas really well. We worked a lot on our transition as well and protecting the ball. I think maybe we should have protected a little more on occasions or even spread it more when we had the opportunity. The three-time CAF Women's Coach of the Year further reflected on the overall performance on Banyana on the day. I thought that everything they threw at us, we handled it very well. I think our transition were really good, but decision making in the final third could have been better on occasions and we could have been in, she added. When we scored, we still had control of the game. I think the own goal came at an unfortunate time and that put us back a bit. We always knew that physically, they were always going to challenge us, especially Ariel. But I thought we handled that extremely well throughout the game. Elise went on to state that she is proud of her troops as they played according to their game plan, regardless of the outcome of the match. I'm really proud of the players. We had a game plan and we played according to the game plan, but we didn't take our chances, explained Ellis. And being the side that Sweden is, they had players with resilience and they kept coming in us. However, I felt like our defense and everyone else played well but just couldn't hold on till the end. So this is it guys, this is how Banyana Banyana lost 2-1 against Sweden. And that's all for today, please make sure to subscribe and like the video, please don't forget to turn on the notification bell so that you won't miss any of the future updates from this channel.